So that's the most important part of what we do here today. Um, but catching up is good too. So you had commandments yesterday? Yeah, which we didn't get through all of them because I passed it back yet. Okay. My brother yelled at me. Well, that's okay. It's his, he's the leader, and if he felt it was more time needed for my My this. brother yelled at me because we came out five minutes late. He should learn patience. So what we have been looking at is the book of Acts, and... It's a good thing to start always with prayer. Now, Stephen, what happened to him? You remember Stephen, Amanda, or no. Brandon? Stephen? Um, I wasn't here at the beginning of it. Yeah, but I think you heard me talk about Stephen. There were seven guys that were chosen to oh. take care of the food for the needy. And two of those were uh, Stephen and Philip. And Stephen... And Philip were more than administrators helping the poor. They also shared the word of God. But as they shared the word of God, people got mad at them. The leaders of the Jews got really mad at them. In fact, so mad that what did they get the people to do to Stephen? Do you remember? Um, remember? Stone him. Stoned him. That's right. I knew you knew. Right. I that's correct. They, they stoned him. Uh, can you imagine being stoned because you came to the rock for Bible study? But mm -hmm. that's really what we're talking about, is that... Well, I mean, today in today's technology, if someone throws a stone at you, you can pull a weapon, but... <laughs> but what I'm talking about is that it's not <laughs> inconceivable. <laughs> what, what are we getting up and walking around I for? Got, I, I got to pee. Okay, oh, yeah. hurry up, okay? It's not um, inconceivable or, or far-fetched or too far away that um, we think about how uh, people get mad at us because of our faith. Uh, there are some people that make fun of us, some people that call mm -hmm. us stupid, and so on and so forth. Uh, what's up? Um, uh, so what happened was Stephen got stoned because of his faith, so we can really be thankful that God uh, has given us a country that that doesn't happen to us. Have you ever been made fun of your faith, though, in Jesus? Mm -hmm. Ever? Yes. Yeah? Can you think of any <laughs> examples? My, my dad last night. That's right, your dad. Uh, yeah, he uh, tends no, to do that. No, literally last night he started making fun of me because of what was on my pumpkin. I got that before I went up to Bible study last night. What did he say? He was making fun of what it said on my pumpkin. Well, did, what was on your pumpkin? Um, it had that ribbon and then it said God's with oh, you. Oh, he was making fun. Yes. All right. See, he so, also, so he also attended when he did that. I also ended up getting mad because what the cat did. He knows. So where do you have your pumpkin? It's sitting on the bar because Cindy said she wanted it by the window. Good, good, wonderful. Uh, that you have. You're not embarrassed. You're sharing your Savior hmm. and uh, God who loves you. Um, but I came to agreement with that, um, my dad because we do it every year. We do pumpkin smashing, so since it's such a small pumpkin, after Halloween we're going to smash it. Yeah, but it uh, rots anyway. So. Yeah, it rots anyways, and one way or another it's going to end up in the garbage. Did we talk about Simon the sorcerer, who at first was yeah. uh, an yes. unbeliever and tried to make money on we, we being... Were, we were just through that a little bit That's when right. it had happened. Okay. He was a sorcerer and everything he, uh, um, when uh, he saw... I can't remember who it was, lays hand on someone, says that God is with you and everything, that he could get that. Right. Do the same thing, but make money off of He that. wanted to make money off of God's work. Right. Pray, and that'll open up our Bible study. And then uh, let's take a look at Philip. Okay, a little awkward pray, but... All right. Keep Mr. in the front couch. Okay, we'll do that. All right, we pray. Dear Lord God, thank you very much for bringing us together today to study your word. Help us to be very uh, interested in the word, interested from our hearts, knowing that your word is the most important thing for our lives because it shows us Jesus our Savior. But teach us to come to your word often because our faith can fail, but with your word it can't. It'll be fed with the food of your word for eternity. Help us then always, dear Lord, to trust and believe in Jesus for forgiveness and salvation. Take care of our friends in Christ, like Brandon and others who are going through different things. 
Uh, bless them according to your grace and love. Make everything work out for the good as you have promised. In Jesus we pray. Amen. Dear Lord God, thank you for teaching us about Saul, who was the persecutor of Christians, but by your power through your word was brought to be the missionary to the Gentiles, was brought into faith uh, for eternity. We pray, dear Lord, that as you opened his eyes of his heart to see you as his Savior, uh, that you continue to keep our eyes open as well. Thank you for opening the eyes of our hearts as you gave us faith to believe in you and faith to see you as our Savior, our Lord, and our God uh, with whom uh, we want to be when we go to heaven. We pray, Lord, that you help us to live each day then with our eyes open uh, and living each day for you and to your glory. In Jesus we pray. Amen. Amen. So that means that we uh, don't talk while I'm talking and we have a little fun. Uh, what we do is uh, we, um, we take a look and we're, we're looking at Bible characters right now and they may be repeated so it's good for you to keep uh, focused on the other teams as well. We got one team here that's made up of three, then four, then five. Isaac, are you going to give me some problems today or are you going to be all right? Thank you. All right. Okay, so we'll start with team one, and Leonardo will give the first letter. Give a letter, Leonardo. By the way, the letters will get grayed out as they're picked, okay? I. I. Go ahead with I. Okay, there is an I. This is a Bible character, which means that it's somebody in the Bible, and uh, we'll every once in a while pick a uh, uh, person and talk about him a little bit. You're up. Veronica, letter. Like this. <laughs> Just pick any letter. It's okay. A. a. You don't even have to buy a vowel here. You can just pick a vowel. You're up, Jordan. By the way, we, we go on how many men you save, how, how many people you save. So if they save this person, then they get one point. Leah? Okay, go ahead then. Pick a letter. E. All right. No E. Leonardo, you are up. L. L. L is already chosen. Oh, it's already picked. H. H. Those are the I, not L. Nope. Nope. There's no Gale in the Bible, otherwise that would work out well. Dear Lord God, the God of all comfort, we pray that you comfort Cody and Colton and their whole family as they grieve and go through this trial. We pray, dear Lord, that you continue to do as you've done, and that is provide people who love and care for them. And also you remind them that you are with them as their dear, heavenly, and perfect Father. Help us, dear Lord, to remember that you did not plan death. Death came into the world because of sin, but you're the one that has given us forgiveness of sins through Jesus our Savior. Help us always to believe in him, to trust in him, so that when we die, we go to heaven to be with him and be with you forever and ever. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. Bye-bye.